We're joined now by Rob Arnott. He is Research Affiliates founder sitting next to me on set. Rob, it's great to see you. Good to see you. Let's talk about NVIDIA because you warned in September that you saw a big market delusion in NVIDIA, if I believe that. It was a great company you wrote, but it was priced beyond perfection. We're up approximately a zillion percent since September. I think it's two zillion. Two zillion, two zillion <laughs> since zillion, September. Yeah. So yeah. if it was perfection that it was priced for in September, what is it priced for right now? Uh, it's priced for beyond perfection. It's, um, it, uh, rather than singling out a single stock, I think it's interesting to note that uh, back in 2018, we uh, developed a definition for the term bubble that you can use in real time. Mm. And that definition was very simple. You would have to use implausible growth expectations to justify the current price using a conventional dis discounted cash flow model. And the marginal buyer doesn't care about valuation models. Um, it fit that definition. So did Amazon in 2000. Mm. But isn't it interesting to note that in the year 2000, the 10 most valuable tech companies on the planet, zero out of 10 had beat the S&P over the next 15 years. Mm. None, one out of 10, Microsoft, had won over the next 20 years. So when we say if perhaps we are in a bubble right now, that doesn't pretend that this is something that, okay, maybe it pops and then it stays there. Bubbles can reinflate. I mean, they should can. we be scared of bubbles if we are in a bubble? I don't think so. I think bubbles are represent opportunities. They represent market volatility. Volatility can be our friend. Mm. You, uh, you should never short sell a bubble mm -hmm. because it can go up to zillion percent. Mm -hmm. But you can choose not to go for that ride. Mm. You can choose to use the opportunity to pivot into markets that are cheaper, markets that are priced not for perfection but for disappointment so that if there's less disappointment than expected, th this is the thing about deep value stocks, they're priced for uh, horrible outcomes and they can soar two gazillion percent. <laughs> uh, uh, merely by <clears throat> merely by not uh, uh, floundering as badly as feared.